Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. We are here again um, with some new content. Today we're gonna talk about all, not all. We're gonna talk about about half of my shoes. I'm gonna show you about half of my sneaker collection, Jordan and non Jordan. So yeah, let's just get into the video. I don't like talking too much. So. We starting off with the non Jordans. That's what we gonna start off with. So, first pair I got here, we got Air Max 97s. These are my fucking go-to, cause all of this right here is 3M. And when it's not in the light, you can't even see this cheetah print. So yeah, these are lit. I wear these a lot. These are one of my go-tos. Next, we have Air Max 98. These are fucking fire. Like, I got these because Halloween is my favorite holiday. These remind me of Halloween. Like, and then they got the lime green, which is my favorite color slash my birthstone color. Like, these are fire. I don't wear these a lot. I probably wore these once. <laughs> Next, we have another Air Max 98. I like these two. These are calm. These just not no everyday shoes, but just calm, you know, regular. And next, we have one of my faves. I have wore these down to nothing. Like, I hate when my shoes get like that. That's just, I just wear them out. My best friend bought me these for a birthday gift. I forgot which birthday, but I love you. She got me these. I also got these from her. Uptown's Wheat. I got from her. Oh, and these are Nike Dunks Wheat. Not Jordan Ones. And these are Air Force One Wheat. Okay? So, yeah, I also got these from her. She bought these for herself, but they were too big, so... I got them. Next we have the Pimpins. I love these fucking shoes, y'all. I love these shoes. Listen, I have wanted these forever and I've always wanted the white and black colorway. And I refuse to settle for the white and red or these. But one day I saw these on the shelf and I was just like, let me just see how they look on my feet. And I had an outfit that matched the blue and it, it was love at first sight. So, yeah. And now we going on to the Jordans. We gonna start from one and go all the way to the highest number. Now remember, this is not, these are not all my shoes. So there's gonna be a part two video coming and y'all gonna see some more sneakers, Jordans, Converse, Vans, all my other shit that I didn't show today. Right now, so let's get into these ones. So, first one I got these were women's shoes, women Jordans. These when they dropped, um, Nike High Zip, some shit. I don't remember the whole name of it, but these I love these too. I wore these out. My second one, these, I've had these since 2013. And these were like my work shoes. I worked at Waffle House, I worked in these. Um, that was pretty much like the only real job I had. That and Target, <laughs> I worked in these. You couldn't tell me nothing. I was working in my purple and black Jordans. And they still fit me like, my foot has been the same since I was probably like 13. I went from size five to five and a half and that's it. 
the next one we got is the i believe these are the celtic ones that come with the gold laces as well i bought these when i was in um high school because these were my high school colors like so freaking crazy and um 2014 i got these these are beaters too i wore these shits out like every school event everything related to school i wore these <laughs> we got some lows these are my only lows I don't really like low shoes I don't know I think high tops look better on my feet but yeah these are some basic ones now on to the threes so I have here the sport blue threes I love these shoes got them when i was like i don't know they old as fuck though just don't and um these are for sale on my depop so if you follow me on depop or if you looking to buy sell or trade go to depop check me out sue young i'm gonna drop my link yes next we have the crimson threes I barely wore these shoes. I think something went wrong with the manufacturing of these shoes because they are my size, but they're too small. I don't know. Selling these two. Next we have the fives. I got the laces and the little thingy. I just think I took them out for cleaning because I'm selling these as well. I don't really got nothing special to say about these. I bought these at um, Plato's Closet. They're also like a good place to get used stuff for a good price. And it don't be like used used because I got these for 45 bucks. Like, listen, that's not used. It's damn near new, all right? Plato's Closet, check them out. Now, I'm gonna tell y'all something about thrifting like if you know what you're doing you can find some heat some name brand for the low i mean like seriously like goodwill plato's closet where else do i go like um damn is this one spot in new york what's it called out of the closet like all these little places they be having some heat you just really gotta know what you want and like when you go in, don't be looking at everything. Know what you want, know what you're looking for. And if you know your product, you're gonna know the material you're looking for. You're gonna know like little things you'll know, like, oh, that's Louis. Oh, that's um that's that's some real Jordans. Oh, that's some Nike, oh whatever. Like if you know like your fashion or your shit, when you go into these thrifting places, you'll be able to spot out some good shit and get it for the low and it be in good condition like it's brand new like don't be sleeping on no thrifting because i buy shit and then i give it right back basically there's no shame in thrifting like now we got some sixes ain't nothing really special about these i just bought these because they went with whatever shirt I had at the moment. <laughs> I think I'm selling these as well. Um, most of my shoe sizes are five, five and a half, and there's some four and a half as well, just in case you are wondering the range. Another pair of sixes I got, Sport Blue. It's like a pack, like. And then I got the 12s to go with it that y'all about to see. I mean, yeah, the 12s. So, yeah. These I'm selling as well. These are actually too big for me. Got these from my cousin. These are a size six. I don't even wear a size six. And we got some sevens. Um, The hair sevens, yeah. That's what these are. I also got these from Play-Doh Closet. 40 bucks. Like, fairly new. I really dirtied it. It was not this dirty when I bought it, but I wear these a lot. Like, 
These are another go-to, another beater, whatever. I don't have any eights, nines. I got 10, which I'm not gonna see that today. Y'all gonna see some 11s. The classics, like these are so old, like they're also too small for me, four and a half. These shits are beaters, but I'm gonna probably like restore them and just hold on to them. Cause these are four and a half, small feet are really hard to sell. And then these are really like beaters, beaters. Like it ain't no minor, minor um, flaws. It's very major. So we got these 11s, Ugh. Concord 11s, of course, throwbacks. I think I want to sell these. Um, I don't know. I want to rebuy them because they're starting to yellow on the sole. And I also lost the box. I have no idea what happened to the box because I have almost all my boxes. I don't know. Shit happens. But yeah, I think I'm going to sell these as well. And these are a five and a half. Okay, so next we have Royal Blue um, 12s. Might as well show you all of them at once. French blue 12s, new buck 12s. Now, I had these since I was in like sixth grade. I'll never get rid of these. I love, I love the new buck 12s, okay? All right. French blues, they all right. I just got them just cause you gotta have a pair of these if you a sneakerhead, right? Right? Now, this fell off when I first got them. And I think that was also a manufacturing issue because I also heard that they started to use cheaper material to make Jordan now. Nigga, y'all need to stop. Like, Jordan making way too much money for y'all to be cheap. So, yeah. And these Royal Blue 12s, I'm selling these. Um, I like these, but... They just are all blue shoe. Eh. Got the 14s. These are my favorite pair of 14s. They're a little dirty, but for the most part, they pretty good. I got these in 2014 when I was in high school. Um, A lot of my shoes I just bought just because I love Jordans. If I love the colorway, I was getting it. Like, it didn't matter. And I have a lot more, like, shoes upstairs so that's gonna be video part two and then we have these 14s that i'm selling the cool gray 14s um yeah these are all right. i got these from plato's closet as well probably for 40 bucks as well or maybe less so yeah plato's closet is the shit y'all y'all should really check it out and Look at my nails, like, can y'all see that? Like, thank you, Lush Nail Bar. And um, Toco, Toco something. But shout out to you ladies. Y'all did y'all thing on my nails. And on my feet. <laughs> Y'all did a good job. And thank you guys for watching my video. If you have any question about my shoes or the name of my shoes or if y'all wanted to purchase, y'all could go to Depop. I'm going to drop the link to everything. Um, and that's about it. We'll be back with another video. Hopefully very soon. Bye, guys.